Okay, time to talk about some of my favorite functions in Excel, the rand and rand between functions. So these are essentially random number generators, and they work in slightly different ways. Um, the first is the rand function, and when you write it, you literally just open and close the parentheses without anything in between. Uh, just like you see here, there are a few functions in Excel, uh, like today and now, which we'll cover in the date and time section, uh, where you write it this way. There's there's actually no components to the formula besides the formula name itself. Um, and what the rand function does is it returns a random number between 0 and 1 out to, I believe, 15 digits. Um, rand between is similar except that you can specify the range that you want to determine. Um, and it will return whole numbers between your range. So if I wrote rand between 0, 100 and filled out this array, from A1 through E6. Um, here's an example of what I might see. Um, keep in mind these are volatile functions, meaning that they'll recalculate or re-randomize with any workbook change, so just be aware. Um, I'm going to jump into just a blank Excel workbook to really quickly show you what these look like. In cell A1, I'm going to do a RAND function, so just R-A-N-D, open close parentheses, enter. As you'll see, I'll drag this out, drag it over, and it's just giving me a series of random numbers between 0 and 1. And if I go to the Formulas tab, click Calculate Now, you'll see that they consistently change. Now I'll just change, instead of rand, I'll do rand between, and why don't we just say 0 to uh, 100, and then close the parenthesis. And once I apply that to the same range, you'll see that I'm dealing with a similar random number generator, except in this case, all my numbers are whole numbers between 0 and 100. So there you go. Two examples of random number generators in Excel using RAND and RAND between.